if a doctor spend 26 hours a day reading, that's how long it would take for him to keep up with how much information is coming out in terms of best practices. And even in best practices, when people do the research, it takes them about 17 plus years before it even comes to a best practice at the hospital. Our clinicians, our doctors and nurses and pharmacists take all this medical research and best practices and condense it down to maybe a seven or eight page actionable order set or checklist for the doctor to use at the bedside. With order sets, it allows us to basically take that, shorten that 17 year life cycle down to roughly about three months. Because we deal with PHI data, uh, personal health information, you have to take it very seriously. And when it comes to data residency, encryption at rest, all the stuff there, and all built in-house. As we grew, it became way more work, and a lot of work, a lot of expertise required to actually support our own servers, our infrastructure. The solutions we're using with IBM are specifically the infrastructure as a service and platform as a service. Working with IBM has been great. They're always available to us and they're always listening to us and what we need and getting the right people to help us solve our problems on a day-to-day -day basis. All those server issues that we know and deal with from an IS perspective has been all covered by IBM. Even when it comes to a platform as a service, you know, even running our own Kubernetes cluster, we thought about that for even a bit. But, you know, not to have to worry about where the, that server structure is up has allowed our, our DevOps team to really just focus on building tools for the developers and operations to really drive quicker turnaround times for our applications to our clients. It's been a great choice from our perspective. Um, when working with IBM, we'll continue doing that.